Hello everybody and welcome back to my next video. This video is a little bit of an impromptu YouTube because my Kingsley boots arrive. Whee! I've been waiting on these boots for ages thanks to Brexit and thanks to Christmas. I mean, how dare it, you know? So, um, I've been really lucky recently. I've just been sponsored by Kingsley Riding and they are an amazing boot company. But that's not all they do, they do riding boots and literally you can have whatever you want. They have a whole configurator, which I'm gonna explain how to use in a bit, where you can just make your own boots. I think they have like 400 leathers to choose from. So there's a lot. There's something for everyone. But they also have a new footwear range. So like a fashion footwear where they do like trainers, boots that are kind of like Doc Martens, cowboy boots, you name it, they do it. So I've been wearing those on my social media for a while, you guys might have seen, whilst I've been waiting on my boots to arrive. They also do saddles, bridles, girths, that sort of thing. So like, they're a top leather product company and they are based out of the Netherlands. And they sponsored me just before Christmas, which is crazy and told me that I get three pairs of boots of my choice. So it was just crazy, it was a bit of a whirlwind and I just knew the one pair I needed, needed, didn't want, needed, was a grey pair. I've been wanting a grey pair for so long. They arrived yesterday um, and I'm gonna unbox them and we're gonna have a look. I'm gonna try them on, I'm gonna show you what they look like, I'm gonna show you how to use the configurator and we're just gonna talk about my amazing new boots because I'm in love. So, the everything comes like this. Comes in a beautiful bag. Um, I have matching spur straps and a matching belt. These two little packets. Let's, should we just, let's just open them. Oh, just look at that. Just look at that look at the detail so these i believed are in their brushed leather or their polished leather i didn't go full patent because i'm just i the one scratch and game over whereas these i find a lot easier to use like day to day but they're also shiny and clean enough for competition but aren't they beautiful so i'm i'm quite I like simplicity. Um, I didn't pick anything too wacky. These are my competition pair. So I definitely need to break these in, but I needed something that was elegant, uh, simple, but quite classic. And I just think these detail, this detail at the top, the spiky bits, or like crystally bits, they're black crystals, are beautiful. So that is my black pair. I am gonna try everything on in a minute. So I'll show you that. Pair number two is brown. So I've always had a pair of brown boots. I love brown boots, but I've always had quite like bright brown, but I just also got sponsored by Cask recently and I have a stunning dark brown Cask helmet. So I thought dark brown to match my helmet. So again, this is in the same kind of leather. So it's like medium, medium strength because I find these a lot easier to break in but these are the polo boot version which is why they have like a little strap here and they have a strap there so that's the polo boot style in a dark chocolatey brown and how beautiful are these like croc straps I'm not sure if this is there we go it's in focus absolutely luscious absolutely love these. I've already tried um, them on. I got so excited when they came last night that I tried them all on. This is actually my favourite pair. I don't know why. I just find it so comfy. They're just so comfy. So we love a polo boot with the Crocs. Yeah, so uh, amazing. I can't wait to put all these on and show you guys. And they come, yeah, like I said, I forgot to show you the black ones, but they come with beautiful matching spur straps in a brown and a really pretty belt. The belt I accidentally ordered in the wrong size, that is my bad, I'm not gonna try this on. Um, I'll figure it out later. We love this. So, I'm not gonna lie, I think I'm saving the best till last. These boots are not gonna suit everybody, but they are my dream. Like, dream. These babies are happy. You guys ready for this? Grey suede. 
And I know what you might be thinking, not the most practical, but who cares? Look at these. I mean, have you ever seen a cooler boot? And if you have, don't answer that because these are my favorite. <laughs> so I went for the lace-ups, which I think are stunning, but they're amazing because you actually zip them at the back so we don't have to spend time lacing up these bad boys. But they are suede, which, so when I got them measured, I actually was lucky enough to get them measured in Holland by Kingsley themselves, but they measured the suede much tighter because it's a softer fabric so they take into account the fact that it will probably soften a lot quicker so these are a little bit tighter but that's fine because they've got a lot more to give i think but they also put like a leather patch on the inside so obviously that uh keeps them um, newer for longer i presume but i just think these are stunning i, I almost think they're too nice to wear near a horse but obviously i'm gonna have to wear them near a horse but oh. If I could just love a boot, this would be this one. So they are my three pairs of boots. Um, I feel very spoiled. I feel very lucky. Um, Kingsley are an amazing brand. They're, they're not as well known in the UK at the moment, but they are getting more well known. And I think they said to me that they are now, they're, um, you can get measured and you can purchase them from Country Frog, I think. Um, I will link that below or I will just link the Kingsley website and you can have a look but I'm going to show you what they look like on and then I'm going to show you how to work the configurator because it's actually super simple but you just kind of kind of like faff with it. Okay let's go try them on. So we're just gonna go on and we're gonna type in Kingsley Riding. So that's the website is kingsleyriding.com. We click on, oh, look who it is. That is Matt Harnicky and that is me. How cute is that photo? That was from the photo shoot we did pre-lockdown. Love that. So anyway, I believe we go on to footwear. Sorry, my filming is awful when I'm holding the camera. And then we're going to scroll, see if we can find the, we're going to find the configurator, I think it's, sorry, just ignore me, I didn't actually make them on this, but riding boots, oh, that's my leg, look at that, cute picture, we love it. And you pick the style you want, the Capri, the London, Albia, Orlando, etc. So for example, my gray suede are the Orlando boots. So we're gonna click on configure. We're gonna pick one. I think one's wider cut around the ankle, zipper in the back with two protectors. So I believe that's the one I got. I'm gonna click configure. And it's gonna take us to this crazy, oh my God, look at the smudges on my computer. Ignore my filth. I have cleaned it, I promise. It's just the light. So then as you can see, oh goodness, there's all these options. So we start, so the base price is the euros here and then anything you add on will add on. So like we could go and make a boot, but this is it. So let's, let's go on and pick a leather. Oh, but we want, sh ooh, shiny, polished, standard. I'm not sure where the suede is on this one, but that just could, be. oh, it's there. Oh my God, pink suede, let's go for that. So you click it, oh my God, I already know which my next pair of boots is gonna be. We're just gonna change the language because it flitted to Dutch and my Dutch skills are not so good. Okay, so yeah, we want, we want some pink suede. If you want the gray suede, I think it's this one where my, the cursor is, as you can see. And then, come on. Showing some technical difficulties. I think it's my Wi-Fi. Okay, let's start again. So suede, we want pink suede. And then the tops, let's have a look at this bit. 
So I believe, I think it tells you, it tells you exactly what it is. So for example, let's put a strip down the back, which I think could look really cool, which we love. And we could, let's, let's just put it in black for now. Okay, I don't know why I just did that. I think I broke it. Uh, we'll, we'll just stick to the norm. <laughs> oh, that's kind of, that's kind of jazzy. What do you think? Maybe just the top piping will do. So you can literally make anything you want. If you really wanted to go wild, you could add all of these colors, which obviously is not gonna be the cutest, but basically you just go through each avenue and you just pick them all. So you can pick the zip protector, the shaft, the parts on the zipper, the heel, instep, toe cap. There's nothing you can't do. We could even have wacky color laces, I think. Like, I mean, we're not gonna do this, but just for the argument's sake, we're just gonna go yellow. You could have the craziest boots you wanted. And I just, that's what I love about Kingsley. They have so much choice and there is really something for everyone. I mean, you could even get a logo put on or you could have them customized. So I saw a pair and you can have your logo essentially stamped in. Look, you can have your initials or a different stitching color. There's more options. Like if you want them hard outside, extra hard. Sheepskin lining is one of the coolest things I saw because Basically, it just means you can have warm winter boots, which is super clever. And then accessories. So you can get your matching spur straps, you can get laces, and you can also get a belt, which is really cool. So yeah, and you can just add, you could fill in your measurements on here if you trust yourself to measure. And if not, you can get them measured at Country Frog in the UK. I believe you can get them measured at actual Kingsley Riding in the Netherlands. And I'm sure there is various different branches where you can get them measured. Just have a look on the website and they'll tell you. If not, drop them an email. But yeah, that's how to use the configurator. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and having a peek at my new boots. I'm sure you'll be seeing a lot of content of them on my social medias in the weeks to come. Um, links will be below if you are interested in taking a look. But yeah, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and do please like and subscribe.